My name is Jesse and I've just finished class 8 with 408 marks and I'm glad that God helped me through and everyone around me. Primary school has been great, great. I miss most people in primary school. It has been a good school in Nairobi Primary. The teachers teach well. Everything there is great and it's, I'll miss like everything there. And as I go to high school, I'd want to carry those motives. Just because you're getting the physical circumcision, it does not mean that your mind will be circumcised automatically. So you have to like grow and adapt to the changes. Physically, my experience was not that painful. I was told a week earlier so that I can be prepared. And then because of corona, um, the doctor had to come to our house. So yes, it wasn't that painful because I had some painkillers. Circumcision is what marks the passage of a boy into a man. It's like the physical sign of coming from childhood to manhood. And for me, I've been told that it helps medically against infections. And also, like during circumcision, I think also the pain makes someone to become a man. We had really good times. Now, Najua, to say to Tachana, say good and probably <laughs> We pray God for our baby boys, our firstborn, and God in his faithfulness, amazing grace, he gave us you. I've mentioned this to you many times that whenever I look at you, I know that I can tell God anything and he will do it. Up until now, you have been such a blessing. Manoria, you know, adore their family, ma looking up to Makauga. Because of the example that you have set. I can do all things through him. Okay. Very, very proud. Super proud of your performance. Super proud of the young man you have become. Years go so fast. I just remember how you are a little boy running everywhere, uncontrollable. And now you're a young, handsome, responsible man. Thank God for the grace he's given your parents to bring you up. It's my prayer and I hope you'll make it to Alliance High School. I'll be very, very excited to come for your visiting. Alliance High School. Wow. We are praying that you go to your dream school, Alliance High School. And I will be very proud if you go to other house. That was my house when I was there many years before your parents were born. So it gives me extremely, it makes me extremely excited of the prospect that you'll be going to Alliance because I know there there is a very good foundation for you. So again, I want to encourage you to just be who you are. Your parents have done what they can to show you the way. I will once again say congratulations. And I thank God so much because he is a God who answers prayer. We have prayed right, left and centre. And he has given you good success. And for that, we thank him and we praise him and we worship him. You have become of age. And like we've said before, age comes with responsibility. And I pray to God that he will guide you to know that now people will consider you as a grown person and therefore you ought to behave like one. You have very many examples ahead of you. You have your aunties, you have your uncles, you have your parents, people that you can emulate so that you can make the best use of your time and your life for that matter. Faith comes with a creed which definitely informs many parts and aspects of life. So in a nutshell, I would encourage you to hold on to the faith that you have and to deeply invest in learning more and more and particularly sticking to the guidelines that are there in that faith so that you have a consistent growth in your life and in your character and then you have a direction. That direction will lead you to a destination in life where you can look back and say that uh, you can see where you've come from and where you've gone. And the one promise I can give you is that no matter what happens, you'll be in the right path and the only thing you can win is success because that's what the Bible says. He blesses the work of our hands. If there is no work, then God has nothing to bless. And therefore, I encourage you and I want to strengthen you, my son. And I just want to open up to you and tell you the sky is the limit. 
just exploit and get as much as you could from the environments you go into, be it in school, be it at home. God bless you, wish you all the best and look forward to see as you transit to the next step. And as um, Jungaji said, of course we'll come back here and give thanks. So God bless you. Amen. I would like to tell him to dress himself. Um, sometimes it's going to be easy, sometimes it's going to be hard. In life it's all about the hills and the valleys. But it will come a time, if you work hard, you'll reach a plane where you won't have to struggle that much. I feel good and relieved that it has passed and all is well and it has gone well. I'd like to thank my parents for planning for this event, preparing it, and making sure everything was in order and inviting all the people came and I'm glad that it happened. I expected maybe a little bit more people but even those who came it was good. Everyone who gave me advice, thank you for the good advice because I knew it will help me as I go to high school and God bless you.